Did you watch Warrior's speech live on Raw? If not, Warrior will go on to make his final speech and final appearance ever, as the very next day Warrior would unfortunately pass on due to a heart attack. Warrior's speech was short, but it had a lot of context, telling the fans that we had the power to decide the fate of the new breed of WWE superstars. As Warrior would tell us that the spirit of the ultimate warrior will live forever, as if giving his own eulogy, which Warrior would go into greater detail at the Hall of Fame induction ceremony, where he would get off everything he had to off of his chest, reconcile with all past talent, and clear his conscience completely. When I was watching Warrior's speech live, I had a feeling that something was wrong with Warrior. It seemed as if Warrior was having trouble catching his breath. And I distinctly remember saying, I think there's something wrong with Warrior. Now, whoever was working for WWE at that time, I'm not sure why they didn't advise Warrior to go seek medical attention. Because it did seem like Warrior was having trouble. It goes to show you that there's a total lack of awareness in relation to talent. Because anyone in their right mind would have been able to see that Warrior was really out of breath. One week, Warrior is powering up the fans and the following week being remembered for his legacy. A lot of sad faces which could have been prevented. Anyway, what are your thoughts about Warrior's final speech? Do you think his heart attack could have been prevented if backstage personnel intervened and recommended a thorough examination? Or do you think it was inevitable and it was just Warrior's time to go? I personally believe that backstage personnel should have stepped in. Perhaps Warrior would still be with us today.